know this your boy T-Top, top busy, the bear king of the state. And right now you're watching rapgrid.com. Huh? Grown man bars, something you gotta deal with. No matter how many fabricated lines, it won't equal up to this real shit. That might be the most recognizable slogan in battle rap. It's been flipped in nine million leagues by nine million rappers. That ain't had nothing to do with me. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, at what point? In the timeline, does T-Rex craft that and say, I'm going to start injecting this into my battles? It was an accident. I was at um, St. Louis, right after Summer Madness 1. St. Louis, T-Rex, Young Ill. We was, I was eating something, spilled something on my shirt. <clears throat> and Goods was like, yo, I got a grown man ball shirt for you. I said, yo, the only way I could wear a shirt from another crew that ain't that mom is if I injected in my rhyme some kind of way. Oh, that's what GMB stands for. I didn't even know that. Right. See, I made you hot, cuz. Don't ever forget that, nigga. <laughs> Don't ever forget, nigga. But you've been talking crazy. Don't make me have to teach you a lesson, too, mm -hmm. nigga. Anyway, um, so I, I, um, I put the grown man ball shit in the junk. You know, that's like my brother, anyway. Mm -hmm. I'm not a nigga, cuz, bro. Um, so I threw it in the joint. And when I got to my next battle, which was G-Soldier, the white boy said, grown man ball, something he got to deal with. And I said, I ain't, I ain't even know it yet, because that was like a week ago. Like Seneca mm -hmm. dropped the battle like quick. And I was like, no matter how many of them fabricated, I just went along with it. I still wasn't going to stick with it yet. You said at no coast they did that. At no coast they did that. So I was like, damn. But then I get from there to Donnie Menace and Artisan okay. in Vegas. And they said it again. Like, yo, Rex, you ready for me? Like, yo, y'all ready? And they like, you ready? I'm like, yeah. And they go, strong, man. I said, nah, 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 not nah, yet. Now let's do it. And I did it. Now I'm getting the hang of it. So it's like, you know I'm saying? When you get a slogan, I think it should be natural. It should, it's something that should just fall into fruition. Like, fruition. It shouldn't be like, you know, um, something you plan for them to do. It should mean something to you, like Tech Nine got the uh, y'all motherfuckers get it right. He's saying his man yeah, yeah, name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I'm yeah. saying he's saying spittage name, so it means something to him. Mm -hmm. So it's a difference when you stand by it, and then you just making up a joint at the end, like you ain't got balls, like I mean, I don't know. Man. <laughs> so I think that's kind of help help add to your um, well, marketability. First of all, you know what I'm saying. It's something people can grab and take home with them from every battle. Um, are there any other slogans that you feel like are as powerful as that in battle? Uh, at one time, Calico was. With that, it, with that, it's a difference between metaphors, metaphors and, and real rap. rap. That That's shit awesome. meant a lot to me too. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I, he, it was an accident, and it wasn't something that he meant to do. It was something that stuck with him. So, mm -hmm. at one time, that was. Um, that's a good. You know, you know what's crazy about that slogan is that I feel like when a lot of people write their rhyme, the hardest part is to write the beginning, the very first the bar. You gotta always start off with that and get it rolling. Every single and verse, I never do. every single battle. Yeah, I never do. I never start with that shit. I just say it when I get there. Does it get to a point where you're like, like DNA? I, I feel like DNA is stuck. With his slogan, because he said, "Get him the fuck out of here," and then people are like, "No, what else is he gonna get out of there?" You know what I mean, and then he got to get 19 more things to fuck up out of there every time he end the rhyme. You see, know what I can end the rhyme with drama, pop him, hit that nigga check with daylight in the background, saying, "Get that nigga Rex." I can end with this nigga dead. I always try different shit, like. Mm -hmm. Every time I come to the king of the dot, I'm going to go, you know, brought the king from the dots to the king of the dot. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to always blend it up. Mm -hmm. It's like some niggas get stuck in one frame. It's like, it's to the point where now they're used to you going left. How, how can you go right if you never go right? Mm -hmm. So at the same time, I'm, I still got to get that nigga Rex shit going, you know what I'm saying? Which was from the Uncasa battle. You know what I'm saying? So I, I feel like you always should, you always should um, try to have something new in there. 
that's gonna stick around. It shouldn't just be stuck to one thing. Um, I think ball game was powerful at one time, right? Yeah, ball game. Um, still kind of slow it down is a slogan. Slow it down is now. Yeah. Uh, but see, I mean, shit ain't really that. Shit ain't that powerful because it's more cool than like a real life. Yeah, yeah. other people do it. Like other yeah. people do it and. When another nigga slow it down, he just you don't think of conceited right off the bat. When you Somebody like actually did friends. it before. Now Surf got the yeah. I gotta put it in subtitles. Mm-hmm. It's the same thing. Them shits is the same thing. Just 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 different different intros yeah. to it. You know what I'm saying? There's really nothing really special about that shit. Uh Tay Rock got gotta got just you just smack you on real nigga time shit. But then what are you gonna do if he come over here? Say it anyway. Niggas probably say it with him. They say, it with <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They say, 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 they yeah, I, I think I easy different three metaphors of real rap and grown man bars. I think those 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 are the three OG slogans. You know what I'm saying? Cal, you got one, nigga. <laughs> Take them stupid ass bill collector shades off, though, man. Cut that beard, man. Get the fuck out of here, Cal. Hitman is a businessman. I am a businessman myself. You know what I'm saying? It's all about that cake. Needs that other half. We gonna get through this battle, my nigga. We playing with a lot of bread here. You feel me, like? People fall flat. Oh, like Sharon and all that. Look at me. Sharon ain't ran into the right graves. That's all that happened. Go ahead and let him do it. We see it on the internet. Cool. 